Welcome everyone back to the Crimson 15 Podcast. I'm your host, Crimson Sin. And 15 PCA. And make sure to follow us over on Twitter at C15 Podcast. So moving on to DC news. Remember last time we reported on how was it uh, Birds of Prey that's getting canceled? Oh yeah. Like that movie's not getting made. Now it looks like Batgirl is in some, uh, some trouble. Josh Whedon was attached to the project and now he's stepping away from the project. Yeah. I thought, well, that's kind of weird. Maybe something happened or whatever. His reasoning is Josh Whedon the man who made Buffy the Vampire Slayer, which is probably one of the most prolific female action heroes, yeah. says he can't make a Batgirl story. He can't figure it out. <laughs> that's ridiculous. I, I mean, that's that's the, insulting. It is. Why don't you just say I'm working on some other projects and I'm hoping someone else can pick it up and take it? He says he can't do it. Uh, that is, um, you can write some strong female characters. You've proven that. This is coming from GameSpot.com, and they, this is um, from their article. The news comes from the Hollywood Reporter, which says Whedon is stepping down as both writer and director of the project. In his statement, he says, Batgirl is such an exciting project. The Warners DC is such a collaborative and supportive partners. It took me months to realize I really didn't have a story. I'm grateful for Goff and Toby and everyone who's been so welcoming, welcoming when I arrived. So... And so understanding when I, uh, they're a sexier word for failed. You, you, you just completely failed? I, 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 it's, hard, it's hard for me it's to hard believe. It's hard for me to believe. Did they tell him we have to have a woman do this? Is, uh, that, is yeah, that what it is? That's what I think it is. It has to be a female director because apparently he can't write female characters. Buffy was just, I don't know, a fluke, right? Yeah, because remember, when you want to make a uh, spontaneous creative talent, nothing is better than you have to be the right gender, the right race to do something. No. Yeah. That's the opposite of that, guys. Anyone can write anything, guys. If they're talented enough and they've proven a track record, they should be able to write anything. A man can write a strong female character Character. the same way a female can write a strong strong male male character. character. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with that. No. This, this to me, just screams they forced him out because he wasn't a woman. Yeah. That's so ridiculous. And then the state, I want you to say, no, I'm doing something else. Like you said, why make this weird excuse? It's it's so weird for, uh, just the, again, I don't know, I guess my tinfoil hat's on. Because Wonder Woman was directed by a woman and it was a great film. What if a Batgirl movie is a great film and it's directed by a man? Is that going to somehow diminish? Like, is that what they're thinking? And then remember, John, instead, of doing, instead of having to do that, Josh Whedon goes on the altar of all the SJW say, see, look what I said. I can't do it, yeah. guys. Oh, this is so stupid. I, I slit my throat in the arena of shame. I know. For, for, for all the cheering people out there. So, is, that, is that what he did? He just, he just laid on his sword? And called himself a loser that's and insane. a failure. That's insane. And not like he has a bad track record. No, he has a great he, track record. They gave movies. him a, a a a bundled up Justice League, so I can't yeah. really blame him for that. He kind of tried to. Well, do it was he, two different directions. Yeah. That's so why. you had Snyder, and then he took over. That's just ridiculous. I I can only imagine it was because they he either he said you know a woman has to be the one to do it. Oh, they told him to. Or they they forced him out. Yeah, yeah, they forced him out. I guarantee it. So, was there a sexier word for failed? Um, sexy fail? I don't know. What, what Was he trying to be funny? That's when Josh Whedon trying to be funny. It's <laughs> just not that. That was just odd. You're not, just, you're not a comedian. Though. Please, he's, no. written, he's, he's written some funny stuff. It's just, that was just ridiculous. That was stupid. So, or maybe that's his, maybe that's his uh, involuntary code word to yeah. tell him I was forced out of yeah. this. Um, I wasn't looking forward to a Batgirl movie because I knew it wasn't going to be connected to anything. Mm. And the last are, Batgirl thing we saw was the animated one, which was horrific oh they get the killing joke right the, yeah but it was like the rip off of the killing joke yeah. like they did it differently oh they did destroy it yeah, yeah it was completely awful that animated movie was literally the beginning of the end for the animated movies for dc they're all been terrible yeah since then. I, I i think i'm kind of glad with the newest one where they're going to japan might be better it looks like it's decent there's a batman by gaslight and it's like a 19 what was it like a 17th century batman it's so stupid yeah yeah it's like renaissance batman or something like i don't know what the hell that's well he, yeah well the one in japan he went back in the past i don't know about yeah that, that, right? that was like in 3d but there's the yeah. other one that's a by gaslight so See, that's stupid i think that's kind of like jack the ripper type yeah thing. i don't know well i think what it is with batman he's just the most popular character they put him in everything but whatever just see point being, this, but this whole ridiculous. batgirl thing um the new comics at batgirl are awful go back to barbara gordon becoming the oracle and that whole uh, with Hush and all that stuff. Really Go back to that Batgirl, Batwoman, and the new Batgirl. I don't know what where they're going with this movie. You haven't even seen anything. No. There's no script written. There's no synopsis. There's no uh, outline. There's no. nothing out there. I agree right now, I'm going to say 50-50 this movie doesn't get made. Yeah, it's I probably, think it's 50-50 right like, now. Like we said, when we named off that giant DC roadmap, we have a video on that. Check that out. Where I'm like, there's no way they're making all these movies. There's no flipping way. Out of the 20, I said three or four. Again, yeah, know. because Birds of Prey already fell to the wayside. Yeah. 
because they're doing Gotham City Sirens. I it's think Lobo, one, yeah, Lobo's going to fall. Lobo probably going to fall. This one's probably going to fall. Maybe Joker Harley Quinn because Harley Quinn's so popular. Maybe. Yeah. I think Harley Quinn can carry a couple of movies just because you can have uh, Maggie Robbie run around with the, in her pants. Yeah, but that, does that make it any good? Yeah, that makes it wonderful, right? Because I'm, I'm 12 years old again. But yeah, um, yeah and, and, uh, it looks, this looks like to be another, I can, another uh, casualty. Yeah, I bet you probably eh, about three or four weeks we won't hear anything. Won't hear anything. Then they're like, "Oh yeah, it's been shelved indefinitely." Oh yeah, that's what I'm thinking they're doing. They they're wondering maybe we get a female director. If not, uh, we're gonna table it. That's so stupid. But that's if someone has saying. a great story, let them direct it. it. Doesn't matter. Wait a minute, are you a boy or girl? <sighs> uh, it was amazing how we fought so long in the past when they kindled them, letting everyone, and then also all society of everyone being inclusive, and now we're closing the door again. Well, why are we doing this? We just <laughs> talked about directors. We didn't talk about male or female directors. We just talked about directors. Yeah. We didn't talk about male or female writers. We just talked about writers. Yeah. I just want the best of the best. I don't want someone to be scrubbed because of their gender. That's 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 stupid. That's beyond dumb. Absolutely ridiculous. So there's some more, just more weird things coming out of DC. It's just don't worry. Having two different Jokers is going to solve the problem. Yeah, Mike. <laughs> that's not going to confuse anybody. The regular movie goer, they're yeah, not going to yeah, see yeah. two Jokers and not think, "What the hell?" Yeah, so dumb. So ridiculous. Dumb. Crimson Sin here. Thanks for watching, and be sure to like, sub, and share. Also, for the most up-to-date information about the podcast, follow us on Twitter at C15Podcast. 